Hey y'all, Todd White coming back at you once again. And I just wanted to start out by saying that I'm happy to still live in a red state where the fear mongering ain't quite as bad and where, you know, they at least allow kids to go back to school. But uh, at the same time, uh, my daughter is out of school today for a snow day. All right, check it out. Yeah, there's not one bit of snow and there wasn't any forecast for snow. But my daughter's school district canceled all the school today. And like I said, I, I checked multiple sites, had other people check multiple sites. Wasn't even forecast for snow today here in South Carolina. But yeah, that, that's how um, the fear mongers have got, especially since COVID. Before COVID, there's no way they'd close the school down, you know, for just this. Look, it, they literally closed school down today. Yep, when COVID started, heck, they closed school down for heavy winds, and they did. I'm not even joking. There was heavy winds one day, and I'm not talking about, you know, severe heavy winds. I'm talking about something that might blow, you know, your pillow across the yard or, you know, some of your furniture across the yard a little bit. And, you know, they canceled school saying they were afraid, you know, for the buses on the road, like this wind that was probably like maybe 30 miles an hour at the most could blow a school bus off the road but yeah all this fear mongering y'all it, it's just terrible it really is and i feel sorry for all these blue states where all these kids you know still can't go back to school all the parents still have to stay with them and, you know most of the parents had small businesses that's gotten axed you know the whole thing is just terrible y'all but yeah i feel sorry for these kids they put in a bubble i feel sorry for them 10 15 20 years down the line because i mean they put these kids in a bubble they're protecting you know these kids from one little harsh word against them uh, they just made them all so ultra sensitive and everything now yeah i hate to see what it's going to look like 5 10 15 20 years if i'm even still here to see it but yeah it's going to be pretty bad because these people are going to be running the country then and you know they're already you know putting kids in plexiglass boxes here and that's to, to to go to school yeah i'm sure a lot of these um, people in the blue states wish they they could take their kid to school to be put in a plexiglass box but yeah this is snow day down here in the south y'all just wanted to get this on video because uh, i think it's just complete madness y'all complete madness peace